What's up guys? Okay y'all, today we're gonna be making a cute Valentine's Day card for your BFF. All you're gonna need is a glue gun, scissors, a Ziploc bag, it'll be a freezer bag or a sandwich bag, and these cute little templates where I will provide a link in the description box for you to use. Yes, guys. So let's get started. Okay, the first thing I'm gonna need y'all to do is click the link in the description box so you can download the template for this card. So once you download it, I want you to print it on card stock. You can use any color of your choice. I chose white because it goes best with the design. So once everything is printed out, including your little hearts, then you can uh, start cutting. The, the area you need to cut is this outside of this heart. Hopefully you can still see it. You can cut this one if you want a smaller window, but I like the bigger window. So let's get cutting. Alrighty, once you have cut out your heart as I have done, and you cut out your little hearts, now it's time to cut out your Ziploc bag. Like I said, you can use a sandwich bag or a freezer bag. And all I did was to take the part that we cut out from the card, line it up, and then I cut out the edge. Or the edge, yeah the edge so this will be my piece and it's just to make sure it's big enough to go behind the card as you you will see in a minute okay guys instead of cutting the edge like I did originally I went on to cut the center and I'll tell you why so it can this fold I could just have that together because I said it'd be easier to put my hearts in and this is going to be like a little shaker. But after trial and error, I found that it'll be cuter to first glue yes, some inside of the heart. Went on the window thing. Oh my God, Jesus. Don't y'all hate it when that happens? And then glue some on there. And then put the other loose ones inside and once I finish gluing I'll show you guys what I did okay once you glue the ones like I just showed you take the cut out again place it over over your, the the loose ones because these are loose they're not glued on and we're gonna hot glue it down and the reason why we're using the template it's because to make the shaker, we don't want them the, uh, the loose ones to get in the areas that we're not able to see. So, and then we don't want hot glue either being shown either. Okay, once you have your shaker done, you got all of them secure in your little bag, then we're gonna place it behind here. Now, one thing you gotta make sure of is that none of your hot glue is showing through the window. If y'all are not as messy as I am, y'all probably shouldn't have an issue. But, uh, yeah. I had a little difficulties, a little bit, just a little bit. I think this is good enough. And you just want to position it, glue it down, and then take another piece of cardboard, cardboard cord, card stock, Lord. <laughs> Cut it in half, and then you're gonna put it over that. And then you're gonna use, you can use hot glue, but I'm not. I'm gonna use hot, March, podge. Y'all, I'm not even gonna change it. 
and then you're gonna fold it and then I'll come back with the finished results all right guys this is the finished results guys I love this card and as you see it shakes shake 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 as I mentioned all the graphics here for the card will be found in the description box with a direct link I also will include you know the instructions or what have you so if you're interested in making this card make sure you go to the description box and click that link guys I hope y'all enjoyed this video if you haven't already please subscribe to my channel if you like this video go ahead and hook me up with a thumbs up I'll see you guys next Friday shake 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 oh and happy Valentine's Day guys